What's going on everyone? This is Luke from South Beach Sports and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the possibility, a very small possibility at that, but the possibility of Jim Harbaugh, the current head coach at Michigan, becoming the next head coach for the Miami Dolphins. Now, I first want to clarify that this is not a confirmed report or a rumor or speculation. I am simply just raising a question and having a discussion about it. So please do not come at me in the comments calling this clickbait or using my video as a report uh, it's not i'm just simply like i said having a discussion about a small possibility of something actually happening before we get into the rest of today's video make sure to like subscribe and turn the post notification bell so you do not miss a single video i'm going to be releasing dolphins content all off season long so if you enjoy my content and you want to see more videos make sure to subscribe also comment down below your thoughts on jim harbaugh and if you would prefer him over brian flores the rumors of Jim Harbaugh possibly making a return to the NFL really started a couple days ago when sources from both Michigan and the NFL told The Athletic that Harbaugh could be eyeing a return. Harbaugh was the head coach for the 49ers from 2011 to 2014 where he had a lot of success. Harbaugh made it to three NFC Championship games and he had one Super Bowl appearance in 2012. He didn't win the Super Bowl but he had a lot of success in his four seasons in the NFL. Uh, he was fired at the end of a 8-8 season in 2014, one of the weirdest firings in recent memory, and there's a lot of people who think Harbaugh deserves a second chance. So why am I connecting both Harbaugh and the Dolphins together? The reason why Jim Harbaugh and the Dolphins are connected has everything to do with the University of Michigan, which is where both Harbaugh and Dolphins owner Stephen Ross attended college. Ross is a very proud Michigan alumni and he thinks very fondly of Jim Harbaugh, so fondly that back in 2011 Stephen Ross took a flight all the way to California to visit then Stanford head coach Jim Harbaugh in an attempt to make him the next head coach of the Dolphins. There was only one major problem with this in that the Dolphins already had a head coach at the time in the late Tony Sperano. If Stephen Ross is willing to literally fly across the country in an attempt to win over Harbaugh when he still has a head coach, who's to say he's not going to do that again? I think Brian Flores is a fine head coach, but it's obvious that Ross thinks very, very highly of Harbaugh. There were even reports back in 2018 from Mike Florio of Pro Football Talk that stated that if Jim Harbaugh returned to the NFL, the Dolphins could be his prime landing spot. Ultimately though, I do not expect the Dolphins to make a serious run at Jim Harbaugh if he does make a return to the NFL, just because I think, and I think the Dolphins think this way as well, that Brian Flores is a pretty solid head coach. Yes, he does have his deficiencies, especially on the offensive side of the football, but he's shown, at least so far through his NFL coaching career and his NFL head coaching career, that he is an absolutely absolute genius on the defense side of the football, and he has shown that his players fight for him on a week-to-week -week basis, which is huge for a head coach. He's definitely a motivator. And I'm not sure if Steven Ross would be just willing to get rid of all of that, all of that momentum that uh, Brian Flores has created through the second half of the season for Jim Harbaugh, who has not coached in the NFL in seven seasons. Yes, Harbaugh had a ton of success with the 49ers, but it's been a while since he last coached in the NFL. And that is a very, very, very gutsy move to make. If Jim Harbaugh does make a return to the NFL, I could definitely see him going to a team like the Oakland Raiders, a team that's already in the midst of playoff contention. I don't see him joining a team that's about to start a rebuild or a complete makeover because Jim Harbaugh's in a pretty nice situation right now at Michigan. I think he would rather go somewhere where he can complete, compete in the playoffs in year one or year two of his coaching tenure. Another team that would make sense for Harbaugh are the Chicago Bears, who currently have a head coach, but I think we all expect Matt Nagy to be fired after the season concludes. The Bears have a very good defense and a promising young quarterback in Justin Fields, and Harbaugh has shown before that he can develop young quarterbacks with the likes of Colin Kaepernick. That's going to be it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. While I do think the chance of Jim Harbaugh becoming the next Dolphins head coach is incredibly low, I'm still going to throw the possibility out there, especially if Jim Harbaugh officially makes a return to the NFL. Thank you so much for watching again, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on that post notification bell so you do not miss a single video. Comment down below your thoughts on Jim Harbaugh and if you prefer him over Brian Flores. And I will catch you later. Peace.